Okay, we'll go to next topic. Next topic, uh, cell operators, logical operator. Once again, recap. First, we studied arithmetic operator using EXPR style. This is expression, return value. Then, compound style. Compound style. Then, we used floating point using floating point operation using BC. Then a relational operator using test operator. We can test number comparison with one value with another value using status code. We can find out the status because test return will be always boolean. Test comparison value above 500. So greater than 500. If it is true, the result will be true. And test you can compare your string. Who am I? Who am I command? Return value equal to root means then status code will be success. And test there is a cell variable dollar zero value equal to bash then status code will be success if working cell is bash or not so this is all this operator relational operator comparison comparing with one value with another value so eq also equal to operator double equal also equal to operator when we'll use double equal this equal double equal when you comparing with the string kind of string comparison okay this is for numerical comparison status code it will show you that result success or failure so the next topic logical operator so before that you can understand the logical operator usage logical operators there are three operators we will use in logical operator one is called logical and operator then logical or operator logical not operator the three operator and when we'll use this logical operator single conditional statement single conditional that is in the previous test operation in single conditional statement if you want to test test more than one condition more than one condition you can combine the previous one for example login name and I want to compare with my working cell or log username and password both should success then it will login is success like this comparison or alternate any one name is matched will be true like that so we have to test more than one condition in single statement for this kind of situations we can use logical operator okay, in single conditional statement if you want to test more than one conditions we can use logical operator for example if you want to check any range based operation within this range the block should within that range then the block should be enabled or some kind of operations so in cell script we are using if and a is operator we can use ampersand also i'll tell you how to use ampersand and minus o for operator for all logical or not symbol for not operator okay now logical and operator when we use logical and if you want to test condition if you want to test condition more than one condition first condition left to right condition one and followed by condition two condition two then result if you want to test condition one and the condition two okay and compare left to right both the testing is success A dollar question mark success means then range will be zero the result will be success so comparison left to right first condition followed by second condition first condition success second condition is not success result will be false or first condition false second condition success result will be false or both the condition false result will be false like one into one okay say for example keep this table for example who am i command we know and echo dollar zero we know so i want to test who are my command equal to root and check the status code success and test login cell name equal to bash that is current working cell is bash success using test operator I want to compare who are my equal to root hyphen a there is a space between operand and operator I remember the same rule equal to bash 
if both the conditions success result will be success because this is condition 1 and condition 2 condition 2 okay suppose if I open subcell in subcell dollar 0 will be KSH Kuama will be the same same testing if we are using in KSH cell environment Kuamai equal to root and dollar zero equal to ksh sorry bash because i'll take previous one so in this case compare this boolean table first condition is success true second condition is false true with the false true with the false what is the result false so result will be false okay so this is logical operator for and usage we can use suppose i want to test some range test that i'll take one number for example enquiry number it is 550 i want to test the range above 500 to below 5 600 this is a range valid range but in our given variable values are valid so how to test it test dollar environment like your enquiry number above 500 and enquiry number below 600 so this testing is success suppose enquiry number value number value if you put 650 the first condition is success above 500 second condition false so if you check status code false same thing if you put 450 first condition failed second condition is success but again same logic false with the, means false with the true will be false so when it is success both the condition must be true that is a logical and behavior you can take n number of testing test one comparison test two comparison test three always comparison start from left to right this is and behavior style logical and what is logical or operator alternate logic logical or operator for example when using logical or operator I'll put or any one condition is true result will be true that is our behavior 1 plus 0 so first condition true so it result will be true it won't take second one first condition false will compare second one second one is true then result will be true it would take further both the condition false result will be false compare this boolean table whenever using multi condition in the multi condition both the statement is success then we can use both the state condition must be true or alternate logic any one condition true then you can use the possibilities any one condition Say for example, who are my login name? We can test that username who are my output equal to root or again who are my output who are my command output that is I am comparing with command output equal to student any one name if it is success result will be success first condition success second condition false so true with the false same all the test operation you can take u name u name equal to lowercase linux or u name equal to uppercase lowercase linux see the status code success yes u name upper lower means this condition first condition false second condition true in the previous case first condition true second condition false okay. you can compare this condition one followed by condition a or followed by second condition so we should use proper uh, notation this is this one. condition one and or followed by condition two this is for test operations logical or operator alternate logic 
next one is not operator not is opposite of testing we will use more validation I will show you in scripting if test is a success success true what not will take not will say it's a false test is say false the condition is wrong not say no the condition is true this is logical not behavior we will use more on validation so testing again you can take my login name is root it's valid status code success if you put not operate where we should put before the testing you can test a return value or who am I not equal to root false false of not will be true see the statement so not always we are means not always we are using for validation and testing purpose and this opposite of testing so if, uh, I'll, I'll demonstrate more within scripting understand that boolean operator behavior and operator both the condition true or operator any one condition true or not operator opposite of testing result these three operator we can use even for uh, all other other cell also so if you refer some script they used to write like this a b equal to a b hyphen a and followed by suppose for example so 150 greater than 100 this is just a simple testing so this both the condition will be true first condition second condition second condition same statement we can write a b equal to a b double ambition 150 greater than 100 and followed by see this followed by see the previous one if you put double ambition symbol we need to write there is one more test operator is called expanded test operator but we want to make it same instead of using iphen a i want to make it ambition symbol double ambition symbol there is a test operator is called expanded test operator you can write it like this expanded test operator equal to a b ambition followed by you have to close it followed by condition 2 150 greater than 100 like this so we'll discuss more about this in and script topic and conditional statement understand this is expanded test operator we should use proper space between operand and operator open and close bracket so if using expanded test operator we can use all logical uh, or operator we can put like the same pipe symbol pipe symbol say so operators are different but logics are same the different is here we can't use it using the time present directly in that command line use expanded test operator you can use we can follow this symbol also as a logical operators okay so we'll demonstrate the details more and understand the logical operator behavior relational operator logical operator both operator return type will be boolean value boolean operation okay so in the next class we'll continue about this topic and more with file test operator then we'll discuss about conditional statement how to apply because this is command line concept if condition true yes I want to do some true for true part of action the condition is not matched I want to write some validation that given condition not matched you have to follow some rule or XYZ so how to validate and how to redirect the code structure that we will write in scripting in conditional statement so before going to conditional statement the recap one second relational operator and the logical operators usage Okay, so we'll continue file test operator in next class. Thank you.